this part successfully convert the selected disk to GPT format. Today I will show you how to convert MBR to GPT. But before that, I will show you a simple way to fix this problem. So let's get it started. Some users may face this problem. Windows cannot be installed to this disk. The selected disk has an MBR partition table. On EFI system, Windows can only be installed to GPT disk. First thing that you should try to do is to change boot option. I mean from UEFI to legacy. For this, you need to enter the BIOS. In my case, I need to press F1 key. I recommend to check on the internet which key you need to press to enter BIOS in your model. Okay, I will turn on the laptop, press F1 key. Voila, I successfully enter BIOS. Now I need to find boot option. So you may notice that every BIOS may be different, but actually you can find boot option in every single BIOS. In my case, I need to go to the startup. Actually, this laptop support UEFI and legacy. In my case, I need to go to the UEFI legacy boot, press enter, and I need to select legacy only. So that's all. Now you need to save all the changes and press enter. Yes, sometimes this method works, but if it doesn't, we need to convert MBR to GPT. And now I'm going to show you how to do this. So let's get into it, we are in the installation window, click next, install now. Now please pay attention, you need to press and hold shift plus F10 and you will open the command line. Here you need to type next, disk part, press enter, ok, then you need to type next, list disk, press enter. Now you may see my HDD drive and it has 40 gigabyte of space. Actually now we need to select our HDD drive on which we want to install Windows. For the example, if HDD drive have 200 gigabytes and SSD 120 gigabytes, it will be very easy to find the current drive. You can just look here at the size. In my case, I need to select disk zero. So I will type select disk 0, press enter, now you may see message, disk 0 is now the selected disk, after that we need to type clean, and I want to warn you, all information from your hard drive will be deleted, so be sure to save your important files, then press enter, disk part succeed in cleaning the disk, and finally we need to convert MBR to GPT. You need to type convert GPT. After that, press enter. And what do we see here? This part successfully converted the selected disk to GPT format. Now we can type exit. One more time, exit. Press enter. And you can install Windows. I don't have a product key. If you have a product key, of course, you can enter it. Select Windows Edition, for the example, I will select Windows 10 Pro, click Next, check this option, click Next, select Advanced Installation, and as you can see, now we can install Windows without any problem, issues, or errors. We can click Next, and that's all. Enjoy! If this video was useful for you, please like it, and I recommend watching this video on how to upgrade HDD to SSD drive without reinstalling Windows.